in Microsoft Excel how we can create a new custom shortcut key to do any task. Before we create a new shortcut key, the question is why we need to create a new shortcut key. The answer is quite simple to save our time. Here is an example that we can illustrate to understand why sometimes we need to create a new shortcut key. This is a list of tasks that I need to complete every month before month end to ensure smooth month closing. What I used to do whenever I complete any task, I simply select the task. I use shortcut key control plus five to strike through. Then I go to the home tab. I go to the font color and I change font color into red. This helps me to distinguish between what task I haven't completed and which tasks I still need to complete. You can see this I have done in two to three steps. I used shortcut key control plus five. I went to the home tab. Then I went to the font color. Then I choose font color, right? But this all things I can do just in one click. If I have a custom shortcut key, I can do all these things just by using that shortcut key. Now question is how we can create a custom shortcut key for this task or any task that you want. The answer is quite simple. Here we have this icon. This icon helps to record all the steps that we have done. What we can do, let's say we want to create shortcut key for this. We can go to any cell. We can select any cell. We can simply click on this icon. Here we can give name to this macro. Let's say we give this name task completed. Here we need to insert the shortcut key that we want to use for this. Here we have control already. Let's say we want to use shortcut key control shift C. So I will enter here shift plus C. Now description we can add anything whatever we want. Let's say I add here description to strike through and font color red. Now when I will click on OK macro will start recording and it will record all the steps. I will go for OK. Now I will use shortcut key control plus five. You can see font has strike through. Then I will go to the home tab. I will go to the font color and I will choose font color red. Now I have been completed all the steps. Now I simply need to click on this to stop the macro recording. I have clicked on this and now we have our new shortcut key. Let's try this. Let's say I have been completed this task. I will select this. I will use shortcut key control shift C and here we go. Let's say I have been completed these three tasks. I will simply select these tasks. I will use shortcut key control shift C and here we go. You can see we can easily create a new custom shortcut key in Excel in order to do any task and save our time. If you find this information useful, please don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel Microsoft Office Tutorials. Thanks for watching. See you next video. Bye-bye.